Hello, space fans, and welcome to Your Sky Tonight. My name is Tony Darnell from DeepAstronomy.Space. And tonight, I'd like to talk to you about how to find the North Star, or Polaris. Now, for most of these episodes that we've had this summer, we've started by looking south. And since we're in the Northern Hemisphere and we're trying to find the North Star, many of you in the Southern Hemisphere won't be able to follow along with this particular episode. But if you're ever in the Northern Hemisphere, you can try this little trick. So as you're facing south, Saturn is very high in the sky. So is Jupiter, and the moon is just beginning to rise just after sunset in the east. We can also see the bright red star Antares in the constellation of Scorpius. But to find the North Star, we need to turn around 180 degrees and look towards the north. You don't have to know exactly where north is yet, just the general direction. Now the North Star is a very faint star. It is the end star of the constellation Ursa Minor, or the Little Dipper. And the reason we need help finding it is that it's actually a very faint star. Polaris is actually variable. It gets brighter and dimmer over the course of about four days. And it is by far one of the dimmer stars in the sky. Polaris is 432 light years away. And by looking at some of the other stars in the sky, it's rather unremarkable. So to find it easily, we need a helper constellation, something that is bright in the sky, no matter when, no matter where we are in the northern hemisphere, and even visible from the city lights. And that constellation is called Ursa Major, or the Big Dipper. And it's a helper constellation because it is so bright, and you can see it all year long from the northern hemisphere. And to find Polaris using this using this helper constellation, we look for two stars at the end of the, of the Big Dipper. And these are called pointer stars and their names are Mirac and Duby. And if you start at Mirac and draw a line through the star Duby, and you continue going towards the right or northern direction, then you will eventually arrive at the North Star. It's a very simple thing to do. We just use the pointer stars from the Big Dipper to go right to Polaris or the North Star. And you can tell you're looking at the, the North Star by staying out and watching how the stars turn overhead. All of the stars are moving except for one. That star is, the, is Polaris. All the constellations arc over it. You can, and as you see the night progress, we can also tell that the Big Dipper is still kind of visible above the, the northern hemisphere, the northern horizon, but it eventually arcs back up again as in the early morning hours. We can begin to see it again. So try this trick the next time you're out. Look for the Big Dipper and find the two pointer stars, Mirac and Duby, and make a line straight to Polaris. Well, I hope this has helped you, space fans. Thank you all for listening, and as always, keep looking up.